Ugh, we have to eat in here? I think it's kind of sweet. <sighs> Alexis, what's going on with you? What do you mean? Seriously? The room was cute, this place is sweet. I am personally offended by this place. I don't know what you think is nice about it. The town is disgusting. It is gruesome. It is charming. It is quaint. It's like out of a storybook. Alexis, what the hell is the matter with you? <sighs> okay. Stavros is flying in to get me, and I'm going to go live with him for a little bit. Well, that is not happening. And I am appalled that my baby girl has turned into a selfish, duplicitous whore. Oh, hello. Hi. I'm Twyla. I'll be your waitress today. Anyway, I read about you guys and everything you've gone through. It sounds super crappy. Super crappy. I had a second cousin in Elmdale who did telemarketing. He made a ton of money. Turns out his entire business was illegal and he lost everything. Mm. Not quite the same. Yeah, no, he went to prison, which is terrible, but but he is learning Spanish. Uh, no mas le duele. I think it means stop, it hurts. Oh, wonderful anecdote. Could you give us a moment, please? Whenever you're ready. I'm straight over here. I forbid you to abandon our family. I am a grown woman, mother. This is the act of a spoiled child. I think it's unforgivable. I think that you're just super jealous because I'm getting out of here. Also, you have a big thing of dandruff on your eyebrow. Do that. Kids, stop. Stop. The world is falling apart around us, John, and I'm dying inside. Well, I'm feeling a little queasy myself. Oh, brisket. Give Ding me it. some space. 